Good morning, everybody. Thanks for stopping by this week. Uh, a couple small things to go over, one of which I did push a new nightly build a couple days ago, uh, rather last night, um, and I included a new plugin for X input support, uh, meaning that the alpha version of Input Mapper 1.7 can now accept X input devices such as the 360 controller, and it can also, thanks to VGEM, map it to a DualShock 4. Um, which gives you, you know, mappings both ways. Now you can go from a DualShock 4 to a 360 controller or a 360 controller to a DualShock 4. Uh, so that was pushed last night and it's part of the nightly build if you download that. Uh, another thing that I was working on is there's now a self-diagnosing troubleshooter. And this is really helpful because about like 95% of the support uh, request issues I get are all from the same exact issue or you know people that you know really aren't going through the forums and looking at uh, previous instances where their issues already been answered somewhere else um, so now I have a uh, like a question form or a troubleshooter which will which will go through a few questions and based on that it can diagnose some of the most common issues found with input mapper uh, installations so that should help, you know, alleviate some of the more common repetitive issues that I keep getting. Um, other than that, uh, work continues. Uh, I'm working on a new, uh, some new controls for Input Mapper. Uh, if you're looking at the nightly build, you might notice that the mapping section has been missing and is replaced by a new uh, mapping section, which is inoperable right now. Um, I'm working on that currently. Uh, and I'm going through kind of a new method instead of, you know, showing all the mappings all the time. Um, for the new system, it's only going to show mappings that you're overriding. Otherwise, it'll assume you're trying to map like controls uh, to its nearest equivalent on whatever your output device is. So uh, with that in mind, uh, it's, it's going to be a little, you know, less cluttered, uh, a lot easier to navigate, hopefully, uh, if I do it right. So um, that's about it for this week. Uh, keep checking in on all those nightly builds. Uh, there's no notifications or anything when I'm pushing new ones, but it will be on, you know, like a daily, semi-daily basis. So uh, you just have to keep going back and checking that and looking at the, like the upload or the last modified date uh, to see if you have the latest one. All right, guys, have a good one.